<sighs> Howdy y'all, Lone Star Rider here. I'm uh, <laughs> I'm on the side of the road, broke down. Lone Star Rider on his motorcycle. I'm on uh, Highway 83, just north of Falcon and south of, uh, I think it's Sanchez Morales, or you could say Zapata. Zapata's north of here, about 15 miles. Here we have a tow truck coming. Uh, it's going to be taking me into Laredo. I know it sucks. I, the motorcycle is is running but it's just not going it sounds like a clutch it just stopped that's all it did tow truck said he'd be here in about 45 minutes so hopefully he'll get here he's coming from Laredo all right I'll fill y'all in as uh, all this stuff happens tow trucks here this guy to Marndo was headed south they turned around and uh, Made sure I was okay. <sighs> I do not like seeing this picture at all. The only good thing about this is that I've got help. <laughs> uh, Armando came and his boys, they, uh, they were headed south. They're from Zapata and, uh, they were checking on me. And they gave me a name of a mechanic up here, which is a good thing. So, I have to see how that's going to work out. Uh, it's just north of Zapata. Yeah. guys I wanted to uh, fill you in what's happening right now uh, still the same day uh, today is uh, December 5th um, I want to give a big thanks to Amando and uh, for hooking me up with Renee uh, to get my bike fixed uh, that is just awesome big big thank you to both Renee and Amando Kindness of strangers just keeps blowing me away. Um, uh, did not. This is just something that just happened that I was not expecting because everything was just running just fine. Uh, bike was checked out before I left on this trip, and of course things still can happen. Uh, I am in a hotel right now here in Zapata, Texas. And it looks like I may be here for two to three days because it's the weekend and places are closed. And it's going to take a little bit to get a clutch. So that's uh, just the way it is. And I'm really hoping it doesn't interrupt this trip because I'm raising a lot of awareness. And donations have been coming in because of this trip. I uh, And I'm getting encouragements to continue and to finish it. Uh, but Christmas is coming, and I got grandkids, and they're they're depending on. They want to see me, even though if I didn't show up, it wouldn't kill them. But I need to uh, be there, so I don't know if this trip is going to get interrupted or not. Uh, just filling you guys in. Uh, hopefully, I'll get back on the road. I'll be able to finish this uh, trip. If not, I'll just make go into Fort Worth for Christmas and then come back out and finish this trip. I mean, that's about the only way I can think of doing this instead of it being continuous. 
uh, like I was hoping it was going to be. Plus, it's been 30 days. <laughs> I figured this would be done in 30 days, and it's not. Um, well, I want to give a big thanks to all of you. I love you guys, and I appreciate y'all's help. I'll uh, let you know if there's anything else uh, on this uh, because most of my videos have been posted on or late, big time late, over two months late. So uh, the writing for uh, a cure right around Texas videos will probably come out after Christmas. So you'll get to see what has actually all happened through this. All right, guys. Catch y'all on the road.